10 Facts About the Bloody Benders. Number 10. The Bloody Benders were a family of serial killers in the late 1800s that murdered at least 20 people in their home slash general store. More bodies were discovered but could not be identified as belonging to the victims. Number 9. The murderous family included John Bender Sr., his wife Elvira Bender, and their two adult children, John Bender Jr. and Kate Bender, whom some have speculated were actually husband and wife, not siblings. Number 8 The daughter Kate proclaimed to be a psychic medium and would invite people in to talk about spiritualism and to perform seances. She said that she was very connected with the spirit world and could talk to ghosts. Number 7 In May of 1871, the first body of a man named Jones was discovered in Drum Creek, with his skull crushed and his throat cut. In February 1872, the bodies of two more men were found who had the same injuries. Number 6 Killings continued on until a man named George Newton Longer and his infant daughter Mary Ann went missing in the area of the Bender's house. They were headed to Ohio after the death of his wife. Number 5 In the spring of 1873, Longcore's former neighbor, Dr. William Henry York went looking for them and ultimately met the same horrible fate as they did when he stopped at the Bender's General Store. Number 4 On March 28, 1873, his brother, Colonel York, arrived in Kansas for answers as to what could have happened to his brother in Lebec County, Kansas. The Benders acted suspiciously and Colonel York did not stay long. Number 3 The town became overwhelmed with all of the disappearances and a meeting was held to discuss who might have been causing them. Three days after this meeting, it was discovered that the Bender family had fled. Number 2 After noticing a nasty odor in the cabin, residents found a trap door beneath a bed. Once open, they discovered a bloody dirt floor. This investigation led them to discovering seven bodies buried in the Bender's apple orchard. Number 1 The majority of their victims were murdered by a hammer blow to the head from behind a curtain. After this, someone would slit the victim's throat to make sure they were dead, and then the body would be dumped into a small room below the trapdoor. To this day, the whereabouts of the benders are unknown. If you guys liked this video, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe.